Let's talk fall essentials. Not either. You know how creepy I look? I'm not gonna sit out here with a camera. No. Hey guys, so today I have a very special video for you guys, as you can tell up top. Obviously you know what you um, stumbled upon, but I'm so, so, so excited because fall is my utmost favorite time of year. The scarves, the skinny jeans, the jackets, the light layers and layers and layers. I just love so much and I'm so, so, so excited to show you my fall essentials and um, forgive my voice, I've been sick. I've been playing this video for two weeks and diligently putting things together, making sure they were perfect and exactly what um, I really, truly loved and putting a lot of thought and effort into it. And so, finally I get to film it. I'm so excited and I hope you guys enjoy it. So, if you are interested, just keep watching and I hope you enjoy it. Okay, we're going to start with scents, and my favorite scent of all time, especially for fall, um, definitely, would be Leaves by Bath & Body Works. Um, I bought four this season, so I'm kind of embarrassed, but it's definitely, I don't want to run out, because I did last year. And the next thing, I'm going to start with accessories, an oversized men's gold watch. I got mine from Michael Kors for my birthday, and it is definitely a must for me. And the next thing are studs and spikes. You can do them in shirts or whatever you want. I chose to do it in a bracelet. And this is going to be two things in one, an oversized clutch and an, embo an embossed clutch as well. Um, they're both very trendy, and this one's my favorite out of everything. And then just a regular color bag. I got mine from Just Fab. And then the next thing is just a bright color belt. Mine's hot pink. I got it from Forever 21 a while ago. It can be turquoise. It can be neon yellow. It can be anything, just to add a little pop of color to darker fall stuff like if you have like what I'm wearing right now a gray dress it really adds a little pop of color in there and the next thing is scarves um, the first transitional piece needs to be a silk scarf and then you also need a white v-neck which you can throw scarves over anytime and the next thing is two um, it's pastels and large polka dots I love this shirt so much it's sheer button-up top and the white um, really pops to me with the pastels and pastel's not very normal for fall, but um, it's definitely a must for me. And the next is a coated chambray shirt. Um, I don't really see many people wearing these, but I got mine from JCPenney, and I love the fit. I love it so much. It's just perfect for me. And the next thing is an oversized sweater. I prefer a breathable one since where I live, it's a lot hotter, and so it's going to take more time for it to cool down. So this one's perfect for me, and I love, love, love the style and the look of this. It's very effortless. And then the next thing for the more professional girls, definitely need to go with a cropped trouser. I love these so much, and they really, really show off um, really pretty heels. I'm just wearing a black pump, but um, definitely shows that off. And the next thing is just a basic standard dark wash skinny jean. Um, they go with everything. You can dress them up, dress them down, be very casual, be very fancy. It really doesn't matter, and they're definitely a must-have for me. And the next are jewel tone skinny jeans. I know maroon colors have been thrown a lot, around a lot, but I really like the blue color. I think it goes with more things. And the next is my favorite, the leather mini skirt. I love, love, love so much. It's so edgy and so girly, and it's just so fabulous. It's a definite must-have for me. And the next thing is something that I don't really see, or I haven't really seen, are a pair of high-waisted leather shorts. Mine are from the Lauren Connor collection, I think last winter, and I absolutely love them so much. I feel like they're so versatile, and they're just very flattering for um, the big, a little curvier girls like myself. And the next time is a tweed blazer. That was my grandmother's. I know it doesn't fit me that well, but I definitely love it. And cinching it at the waist is not a bad idea. And the next thing is a utilitarian or a military jacket, which is from the Lauren Connor collection as well. And I just love, love, love that style. And then my most favorite jacket of the fall is a leather jacket. And this one has some really pretty quilting on the shoulders. And it just really edges up an outfit. And the next is a tuxedo style blazer which I got from Forever 21 and it really really makes me feel so professional and polished and which I love. Okay for a long sleeve mini dress um, I definitely love this one it's a little thicker but not too much and it's perfect for fall because still a little not too cold 
And also, I love them with these boots. These boots are Sybil. I've had them for a year, and they're I love, love, love them so much. They're a riding style, and they hit right below my knee. And they just go with so many outfits. I can't tell you. I wore them, like, every single day. And these are a mid-heel boot. And I love these because they're more comfortable than the really high heel boots. And they're just super trendy looking. And they're just, yeah, there I am bunny hopping. Don't ask me why. And hopping on with Anderson. These are an ankle booty from Just Fab, which I love. They're very, like an urban cowgirl type thing, which I'm loving. Um, and next are my favorite shoes that I'm showing you are these pointed toe white pumps that I got from Kohl's for 13 bucks guys and the second thing that's an essential this that is trending are metallic um, accents and instead of doing a cap toe I want to do something different so I got these that um, were metallic on the heel and the next thing is a must for any girl is a leopard flats these are versatile throughout the entire year uh, maybe not if really really cold winters but they're very they go with so many outfits they really are the basic neutral and I'm running off, so much fun, run back on, and these are what they call a quirky sneaker. They're um, by Ralph Lauren, and they're like um, a Converse shoe, but I think these are more comfortable and a lot more stylish and more me. Alright guys, that's my fall essentials. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I definitely did, and I cannot wait to wear these pieces this season, and a lot of this stuff for me will last till winter, because um, where I live, the winter really is fall time if that makes sense so um, I'm still gonna be in summer for another couple of months unfortunately but um, doing videos like this really ups my spirit because I love fall so much so if you have any questions comments concerns anything leave them down below don't forget to subscribe up top and, and also I'll have um, everything listed in order of what I showed you and on down below and where I got them and I'll see y'all later bye